Road Trip 2021 and in Breckenridge at Breckenridge Distillery with Jesse. Jesse, show us around. All right, we're going to go on a super quick tour, so follow me. Yeah, it's going to be quick, so you pay attention, stick around. To the left is our patio, full of exciting puppies, dogs, friendly faces. But where I'm about to take you is only available via reservation, so it's totally exclusive. Ooh, thank you, my friend. Now, as much as this looks top secret, it's not top secret, and we'd like to show it off now, but All by right, reservation. All right, fair enough. So quick peek, get your camera in there. That's where you guys are going to be hanging out for your after show. Ooh. That is the Dark Art Society. It is an exclusive whiskey club, which you can become a member of for a small fee of $7,500. But that gets you five years, and you pay for it in booze. Wow. I and you get a locker, too. You do get right? a locker. And, and uh, access to there? You do, yep, and it's also doubles as a private dining area. So this, guys, is the newest addition to the Breckenridge Distillery. This used to be our bottling room, and we're distributed in 50 states, and every bottle came out of this place by hand or by machine. Wait, say that one more time, because that, that's pretty cool. It's intense. We bottle by hand. We have a machine that also helps us, but a majority of it used to be by hand. So this room, guests can come in and book a high-end whiskey flight experience or, better yet, a blending experience. So we'll invite a group in here. Um, one of our distillers will actually guide you through a blending process, just like we do actually in our production facility, which I'm going to show you in 2.5 seconds. And uh, you actually get to blend your own whiskey, bottle it, label it, wax dip it and take it home and then you can actually purchase more bottles of your own blend that nobody else in the world will have oh my god wow. guys, how about that for vip try and convince that your bride cool. to get married here guys this is yeah. where you want your wedding venue Absolutely. what is the most unique whiskey that you have uh, i would say it's our dark arts it's a single malt um it's an american scotch style it's actually what brian founded the distillery on he did a scotch tour in Scotland and came back and was like, nobody's really doing an American scotch. So Look at the what's the most expensive bottle? The Dark Arts. It and ranges from about 275 to 299 depending on where you buy it. Look nice. at uh, our newest release right behind Greg here is our rum cask finish. So it is our 86 proof bourbon that is then aged in our own spiced rum barrels. And it is flying off the shelf. Brian says, quote, it is the best whiskey or I guess spirit we've ever made. And he's afraid that nobody's gonna buy anything else. Really? Which hasn't been the case because our numbers are good. But not nice. just whiskey and bourbon, other spirits as well. Yeah. So we do gin, um, and we have a few other gin skews coming out, hopefully towards the end of the year, uh -huh. beginning of next year. We have four flavored vodkas, Akavit, um, and probably more to come. We have a, a peated whiskey coming uh -huh. down the line. I have an espresso vodka. That Ooh, and you, so you good. You have a bitter, though, too, that I've been dying to try. You have a bitter. It's more of a try. sipping bitters than a mixing bitters. All right down to the last stop before I go. hand it over to you guys to have dinner. Whoa, watch out for this. <laughs> Heading on in, and I love this. This is production, and this is where it really Welcome all Welcome to happens. our production facility. So right behind me is our original production facility. This is where it all used to happen. Um, you look at this, and then you, you take a quick right behind you. This is 10 times the size. So this is our newest production area. It's been open since 2018. I just, can I go? Whoa, whoa, two, three, this four, is, five, look at those six, columns. Seven, eight, nine, 10, that 11, is 42 12, 13, 14, feet. So whereas this original production facility will pump out one barrel a day, we are doing an average of 22 a day in this. So that kind of speaks to our growth um, across the country. We're in eight, uh, across the US and we're in eight countries. So we have a very loud bark but still wow. a mom and pop distillery, which is what I love so much about what we do here. So uh, that's got to refine some of the best whiskey ever. Yeah, I would say this is allowing us to produce 100% uh, grain to bottle whiskey, as well as continuing our blend as well. Um, it's, uh, it's producing some award-winning hooch to say the least. I got to tell you. Do you have anyone buying This is an inside house? look right uh, now. We do, yeah. There is uh, one business, the Ritz-Carlton out in uh, Beaver Creek, I, I believe. They um, have our only single barrel program um, as far as what people can get. We have a single barrel that's distributed across the country that is 100% grain to bottle Breckenridge. And then we also do really cool uh, uh, things for accounts and, and liquor stores called the Reserve uh, Blend Program, where they can actually pick a blend, have the barrel, take it to their uh, 
off-premise account and it's displayed and they have a little logo on the bottle, it's totally their own. So it's a wow. really cool opportunity cool. for guests. Collaborations are always cool too. We have one, yep. one minute left with you. Just wrap it up here, talk about any collaborations, what you're doing promotion-wise and into the future, but come out here and, and visit. In one minute, In one all minute. right. Well, we have a lot of really cool stuff coming up. In August, we are going to be releasing an insanely massive partnership. I can't tell you right now, but maybe you guys will be one of the first to know and you can help I, us announce it. She um, wouldn't even tell us. We have to <laughs> wait, too. It's going to be really exciting. Um, and we have a really cool partnership with Breckenridge Brewery. We have a uh, barrel-aged Imperial Avalanche coming out with them. It's their beer aged in our barrels. And then as we get into Q4 in November, we're releasing a bourbon barrel aged Imperial Stout beer. They are. And we are releasing a beer barrel aged cool. whiskey. Did you get all that? That's a tongue twister. Yeah, one barrel goes to them. They take the barrel, they use the barrel, they bring it back and another barrel goes to you. And that's the collaboration. You guys such, do such a great job. This Thank is you. the best place. The culture here is wonderful. It's just a place you get the vibe and that vibe is what it's all about. Uh, none better. Jesse, thank you for the tour. You bet. We're going to eat dinner, and then we're going to go in that cool lounge and do our show. The end of the day recap show coming at you live from Breckenridge Distillery. That's coming up. Got to thank you. Woo -woo. You're the best. I love it. Nice.